We got about an hour 50 minutes. Today is Sunday, the 22nd of March. The COVID-19 virus is going around and we'll see. I'm going to Mexico City and see if um, I can get there. I'm taking this bus about an hour 50 minutes to LAX. Okay, now I'm on the Gold Line tram all the way to Union Station. I'm on the flyaway bus going to LAX from Union Station and I'm the only one on the bus. We're in the Guadalajara airport. Starbucks. On that flight from Los Angeles to Guadalajara, there's only about 10 people on the whole plane. And it was Airbus A320. It'll probably handle about, um, you know, at least a hundred. Okay, so that flight from Guadalajara to Mexico City, uh, it was uh, almost full, I would say. There were still some empty seats, but that was almost full. So here in Mexico, Within traveling within Mexico, it just doesn't seem like there's a panic going on. You know, they're taking steps for sure, but other than that, uh, it's you know, they got the hand sanitizers, you see those in several different places, and you know, people are wearing masks. Okay, I'm looking for an exit. Yeah, a couple of years ago when I was here. I remember this. I don't remember this Ciudad de Mexico sign, but I re do remember this hall. They were kind of building this out. And then they had this machine here, and I slept down here. And they got all these warnings about the COVID-19 I'm in the northern part of the airport. I don't... Maybe this is Terminal 1. This is the international airport at Mexico City. But I remember this long... Kind of like... Walkway. These glass panels. I remember this. I'm going to the uh, historical center. That's where I have the hostel. And I'm going in that direction, which is west. See if I can navigate my way over there. It's a few blocks away from the Zocolon. So, I think I should be able to find it. It's on Republica de Uruguay. Gotta get across the street. So this is really the only way. It's a pretty busy street. It's almost like a freeway. Right outside the airport. Okay, I came upon this park. It's called Parque... Portino Serrano Oh look at that Very colorful
Montezuma. So far I'm liking it. Uh, my journey to the hostel. We've got a Mercado here. There's a Mercado. It just seems lively. It seems very, actually it's kind of older looking, but you know, people are working and it doesn't seem, you know, unsafe at all. It seems really great. You got these stands. I wonder what this guy is making. Oh, there's a pond here. You see that sign? It says free Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, gratu, gratuito, and it works. Google Maps, it's working great. Walk into my hostel from the international airport here in Mexico City. It's giving me great directions. Internet works too. So I'm all set up, I don't need a SIM card. Mercado San Ciprian area. I'm in the uh, Mercado La Merced area. The Mercado is actually to the left over here. Side of it, you got a lot of stalls outside. Okay, this is Republica de Uruguay and this is where the hostel is. It's called Casa Pepe. It's very highly rated. Entrance way. 